dogs. Now humans and dogs have been stomping through the woods together for well over 15,000 years. We've been through a lot since then. But what we can all agree on is that they are our best friends. We eat together, we sleep together, and we hunt together. Now our relationship isn't perfect. Sometimes we'll let one another down. But one thing is absolutely certain, we love each other unconditionally. On this trip, we're gonna show you a brand new look at this amazing relationship. This is Hustle. That's not exactly a normal way of getting one, but we're gonna keep it. We're gonna see if it's still good. You might be thinking right now, what the heck just happened? Well, I was thinking the same thing. Apparently someone left this bird out there, either fell out of their bag or they just couldn't find it. I'm gonna fall back on the old phrase, finders keepers, losers weepers. He would be such, he would be the best bird dog in the world if he just, just like stayed, you know, a, a quarter of the distance away that he runs away. I don't know how to get him to do that, but he is, he's got the drive, that's for sure. Good. Yes, I'm talking about this one here. He's got great potential, but a long way to go before he's where we want him to be. Or so I thought. Now he's locked in. He's going to change my perception here real soon. I just saw some over here. Come on, come on, come on. What? Right up in that patch of trees, I just saw a bunch. You see one? I saw them flying, yeah. yeah. Right up where Bean's going. Went right over. Did you see one fly out? 
Ja. <laughs> On video two. Good boy. Oh man, that was quite some running right there. So hopefully, hopefully we can find this one again. And we'll I, tell we what think happened. It, we think it flew this way. So, so um, Koa, Bean, and I were kind of walking down this this drainage down here. And there's usually a lot of birds down there because I'm pretty sure that's where they stalk. But Sammy heard one closer to where she was at, and it flew into this patch of this patch of timber right here. And, and we got underneath it. I was thinking maybe it'd fly downhill, but Co kicked it up and it flew on the opposite side of the timber. Wasn't able to get a shot, but it flew this way. So we're gonna wait for Bean to make his rounds and then get come back to us, and, and then we're gonna go after it that way. Go, 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 go. Wow. Good boy, baby. Good boy. Good boy, Bean. Good boy. Good boy. Good job. Good job. Wow. What a freaking point. Bean, po he pointed. I'm telling you, he has the makings to be a great bird dog. Now, I just need to hold up my end of the bargain and be a better freaking shot. <laughs> Maybe next time. That's good. That's a good sign. Good sign. Cody, I'm gonna credit that to you. You showed him where I was at. <laughs> only he listened. Look at him. Oh, he's gone again. <laughs> Go, you're Bean's cameraman. <laughs> oh, man. That was so cool. That was cool. That was so cool. I can't even, I can't even believe that that happened. And Koa didn't even see that bird. He ran right through that patch of wood. Koa's trying his best, okay? He's a lab. He's a retriever. Bean's doing good. Bean's doing good. We're gonna chase that one for sure. I'm so proud of him. You know what, Bean? You graduated. I think you deserve your own best of fifth year. <laughs> that is that is literally crazy. I am just so incredibly proud of him. Even though I suck at shooting. It's okay. It's okay. It's exciting. It's very very fun. You. <laughs> I mean, like, just just like coming out here and walking around is like the greatest time ever. And then you add on top of that having two dogs to run around with makes it even more fun. And then you add on top of that flushing out a bunch of birds. It's like peak funness. Like, this is like my favorite thing to do. And I was gonna say, not to mention walking around with my beautiful girlfriend. <laughs> Thank you.
knows how many birds Bean has gotten up without us even knowing it because he's a mile away. One thing at a time. We found out that he's actually got potential, so now we can kind of hone in his skills a little bit. Now there hasn't been a lot of success yet. My dogs are doing the work and I'm falling up short. Just you wait though, there's still time to turn it around. After all, those won't be the only birds we see this trip. Good boy, Bean. Good boy. That bird flew and it landed like right here. And he went somewhere in this woods. So we're going to wait for the dogs to catch up. And then they'll be able to kind of work, do their magic, and hopefully flush it out. But it's definitely, it's like right in here. I saw it land and I saw it walk in right here. Where are the dogs? I have no idea. <laughs> It was so... It was actually right in front of you. It was literally right in I'm front of you. I'm sorry, but... Oh, my God. I have a really tight choke on the shotgun. I didn't change it from turkey season. Oh you couldn't ask for literally an easier shot than that. Paint's working on it. address the comments saying you can't shoot now i'm a hack with the shotgun i know it i need to practice more he but hasn't practiced I'm, at all i'm gonna say that um it's because i have a really tight choke on this this is like my dog over there i have a a, a turkey choke on this um so i'm gonna blame that <laughs> i am so bad Oh, I get it, all right? I'm a hack, but it's still exciting. Hopefully you guys at least felt a little bit of excitement there. A lot of running, oh, a yeah. lot of training that needs to be done still. Bean's gone. He's off on another adventure, but maybe next time I'll be able to shoot one. We got one. We have one. Not ours. I don't know. I don't know who left it there. There's Bean. Bean did good, Co did great, you know, both dogs did their job. I think, what? how many birds did we get up? Like oh, six? Yeah. And I shot zero of them. It's the first, it's the first time out. Uh, it's the me memories. Cut me some slack a little bit here. And that was fun though. That was a good time. I think now we're gonna, we're gonna head back to the truck, head home and watch the Steeler game. Well, I guess I learned a valuable lesson today, that you can't go all off season without shooting and expect to kill it on the first day. Oh well, you live and you learn. I hope you guys enjoyed and I look forward to bringing more videos to you next week. Stay safe out there and make sure to keep it wild.